So I graduated with like two teachers and the principal and my family there, but I graduated. So since I've graduated and my school does not let us paint our caps, I thought I'm going to paint my cap since they can't do anything since I've already graduated. And we're not having a real graduation, so does it matter? So let's paint my cap. This is my graduation cap. It's literally nothing special. It's literally just, it's, it's, yep. So it's probably just a piece of cardboard with fabric on it. Anyway, I'm gonna take the tassel off and then take the button off, which I accidentally ripped off when I first got my cap. I literally just took it off, but for some reason now I can't take it off. Maybe I'm turning it the wrong way. There we go. If you didn't know, that comes off. And you're left with the little pointy bit. So my plan is to paint it white and then do something abstract on it. If you don't know, if you don't, if you don't know me in real life, you would not know that I plan to attend VCU Arts in the fall. So I'm going to incorporate that somehow. But other than that, I have no idea what I'm doing. So we'll see how this uh, turns out. I just wanted to say that painting and any type of 2D art is not my strong suit. This is for fun. I do these things for fun. If I were to do 3D art, that's different. That's, that's my jam. So I painted my cap white. It's very white. It's also very curved because it's cardboard, but I've decided on a couple things I'm definitely going to include in my cap. I'm going to include these abstract watercolors that I like to paint. I'm going to include the little doodle lines that I do. That's the plan right now. So I'm editing this video and the time lapse that I had taken does not slow down very well, and that's what I was originally going to talk over about my process and stuff, but I'm going to do it here because it does not look good slow down. I'm just going to put, like, music over it or something, but I used the three colors of VCU Arts not just VCU. VCU is black and gold. VCU Arts is also red, so I use those colors. And I did it in the style of my abstract doodles. I don't know what to call it. And I was going to put my like cat humanoid creature thing I do. If you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. If you don't know what I'm talking about, then you don't need to know what I'm talking about. But then it looked dumb, so when you see me paint in the corner something really black and then I put white over it and then I completely cover it up, that was my mistake of trying to put the cat there and it just didn't look good. But then I decided that I wanted to write VCU Arts I was going to write VCU Arts 24, but then I was like, oh, I might take a gap year. It might not be next. Who knows? Whatever COVID decides to do will mess up 
if I'm gonna go to school this year, if we're being completely honest. Um, don't want to go to art school online. So I just wrote VCU Arts, and then in some places you can't really see it because I just decided to leave it white. I was gonna do it uh, VCU yellow, and then art red, because that's what the logo is. Uh, but then I thought it looked better white, and I was gonna keep it- I, I just kept it like that. I think it looks good. And then I had taken off the button, but I realized that I should have just kept it on because it was so much harder to paint the button um, without it on the cap. Anyway, you'll see me paint that at the end very quickly, but yeah, I feel like I don't have a process, but I do have a process. Um, and this might not make any sense, but I'm still gonna put it in, okay. This is the finished product. It's very much like something I would do um, art-wise. So, yep. Okay, I'm back with like a rant, a little rant. Just, I'm just disappointed that I couldn't paint my cap and have it at my ceremony because it was literally just me and like six other people there. I wasn't going to offend anyone with my abstract art. I just, it's so, I'm just disappointed in my school personally that we're not allowed to put something on our cap. So if they decide to give us an official graduation, I don't know, like a year from now, I don't know. Uh, I'm coming with my cap and they cannot stop me. I'm not painting over it. I'll just, I won't show up if they don't like it. Okay, that's it. It's still a little wet, but I'm really happy how it turned out. Even though you can't exactly 100% see that it says VCU Arts, it's definitely there. I feel like grad caps never look, make anyone look good, um, but yeah, it's look good. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that it was a little entertaining and have a wonderful morning, evening, afternoon, whatever. <laughs>